What are nuclear safeguards? Verifying that nuclear material and technology are only used for peaceful purposes is a crucial and complex task. Since the destructive power of nuclear weapons was first demonstrated eight decades ago, efforts continue to prevent their spread or proliferation. In 1968, these efforts culminated in an international agreement called the Treaty on the Non-Proliferation of Nuclear Weapons, or NPT. Its purpose? To prevent the spread of nuclear weapons, ensure that countries can benefit from the peaceful uses of nuclear energy, and pursue nuclear disarmament. A total of 191 countries are party to the NPT, the vast majority are non-nuclear weapon states that agree to use nuclear material and technology only for peaceful purposes. These peaceful purposes include the production of electricity, adapting to and mitigating climate change, fighting cancer, and more. IAEA inspectors verify that nuclear material and nuclear technology are only used in such countries for peaceful purposes, thereby providing the international community credible assurances that nuclear material is not being used to make nuclear weapons. At the IAEA, we call this verification work safeguards. What role does the IAEA play? The IAEA is an independent international organization within the United Nations family. Its inspectors travel to nuclear facilities and other locations around the world to conduct verification activities, such as measuring nuclear material, taking samples, and applying seals and cameras to verify that the material is used for peaceful purposes. Under a comprehensive safeguards agreement in connection with the NPT, a non-nuclear weapon country is required to facilitate IAEA verification of the peaceful use of all nuclear material within its territory, under its jurisdiction, or under its control anywhere. The NPT nuclear weapon states have a different type of safeguards agreement with the IAEA. For these five countries, the IAEA applies safeguards to nuclear material in selected civilian facilities which are offered by these countries. In addition, with three non-NPT countries, the IAEA has agreements to verify specific nuclear material, facilities and equipment. How does the IAEA implement safeguards? By identifying all the technically plausible ways by which a country could acquire nuclear material for making a nuclear weapon, the IAEA sets technical objectives and selects and implements safeguards measures. The available measures are defined by the safeguards agreement between the IAEA and the country. A country may also have an additional protocol to its safeguards agreement, which provides the IAEA with broader access to locations and information. The IAEA collects safeguards relevant information about a country from three sources. Firstly, information provided by the country itself. Information collected from IAEA verification activities, including inspections at nuclear facilities. And other information. For example, open source information and satellite imagery. By planning, conducting, and evaluating its verification activities, the IAEA is able to draw safeguards conclusions. What happens during an IAEA safeguards inspection? To check that information provided by a state to the IAEA is both correct and complete, inspectors may perform various tasks. These tasks can include counting, weighing, and taking samples of nuclear material. The IAEA collects hundreds of such samples every year. From these, inspectors can determine the nuclear material content and, if required, the enrichment level of a sample, which helps the inspector know how this material is being used. A safeguards inspector may also apply seals to check that a container remains closed and install specialized surveillance cameras to keep continuous watch over nuclear material or equipment. Each year, the IAEA maintains more than 1,400 cameras and verifies close to 26,000 seals in nuclear facilities and other locations around the world. 
IAEA inspectors are also on the lookout for any indications of undeclared nuclear material or nuclear activities. To help detect such material or activity, inspectors use one of the most powerful tools the IAEA has at its disposal, environmental sampling. This involves collecting wipes, anonymizing them, and then sending them for analysis at the IAEA laboratories in Cybersdorf, Austria, or at partner laboratories located in various other countries. The IAEA's Environmental Sample Laboratory contains extremely sophisticated equipment which can identify and date any particles of nuclear material present in the dust sample. Even the tiniest amount of uranium or plutonium could indicate the presence of nuclear material or nuclear activities that have not been declared to the IAEA. At present, around 250 IAEA nuclear safeguards inspectors conduct around 3,000 in-field verification activities annually. How do IAEA safeguards contribute to international peace and security? By implementing safeguards activities every day of every year, the IAEA verifies that countries are honoring their international obligations to use nuclear material and technology only for peaceful purposes. Any anomalies, questions, or inconsistencies identified in the course of safeguards implementation are addressed by the IAEA with the country concerned. Through these activities, the IAEA can assure the world of the peaceful use of nuclear material and sound the alarm if there are any indications of nuclear material being diverted for non-peaceful uses. This unique role played by the IAEA promotes trust and remains indispensable to international peace and security.